Our toll patrol is looking for more ways to reduce the money you pay during your commute. You may have noticed the 9 a.m. bridge lift at the downtown tunnel is also when peak time ends. So the cost to cross goes down a quarter. Doesn't sound like much until you add it up for five days a week. Then your side's Andy Fox convinced VDOT to adjust bridge lifts in the past. Andy did this tonight. <laughs> He's taking on the issue again. Nicole and Tom, scheduled bridge lifts at the Berkeley and Dominion Boulevard steel bridges are big success stories for 10 on your side. There was a time when the bridge openings were on demand and tied up traffic all day long. Tonight, we have another suggestion that could save you money at the downtown tunnel tolls. These are pictures of today's 915 lift at the Berkeley Bridge, delayed from the 9 a.m. opening following a required special request. It got 10 on your side thinking, what if the scheduled lift was always at 915, which would allow drivers to get across the bridge between 9 and 915 and pay the lower toll, which begins at 9. Art student Edward Chartier loves the idea. So if the bridge lifts at 915, you can go across between 9 and 915 and pay the lower toll. Mm -hmm. That's right when you're going to work, too. Over the years, we've worked with VDOT to establish scheduled lifts at the bridge. Dwayne Cook is VDOT's regional operations director. You've helped us with the Berkeley Bridge, um, getting that on the schedule, you know, getting the public to reach out to the Coast Guard and express their opinion. It helped a lot. The decision to change the lift time is VDOT's alone, but VDOT consults with the Coast Guard. Open David Keffer, 65 years living in Portsmouth. If VDOT did that, what would you think about VDOT? Uh, they're trying to help us a little bit, I guess. The goodwill VDOT would create is undeniable. You know, to be here on time, I have to leave at least 30, 45 minutes just to make sure I'm here because if I get stuck at the bridge when it goes up, then I'm hosed. Shipyard worker Aaron Grimes wants to chime in too. Have you thought about it? I thought about it, but I don't know if my voice would count, you know. Well, I've been thinking about it. and we're... I know a lot of others that's thinking about it too. Yeah. Get VDOT to push it back to 915. VDOT, push it back to 915, really, coming from Aaron Grimes and the rest of Portsmouth. There you go. The sign reads, bridge closed to marine traffic between 5 and 9 a.m., making that 915 a.m. could help hundreds of drivers save money and still get to work on time. I think that's a very good idea. I don't like the tolls at all, and anything that's going to save me money is good. Yeah. Just moments ago, I got this statement from VDOT. Spokesperson Marshall Herman emailed us. The current schedule is based on congestion periods to minimize traffic jams caused by lifts. VDOT will work with the Coast Guard and maritime industry to evaluate the feasibility of changes to the lift schedule. We have not heard back from ERC what their thoughts are on our idea. I'm Andy Fox, 10 on your side.